Topping. Ito ay pribilehiyo o grant na nagbibigay ng exclusive rights para sa isang inventor o isang individual. Para maibenta ang kanyang produkto o invention for a certain number of years. We have heard that somewhere in Marina Square, at the heart of Singapore's business center, landed a must-try Filipino restaurant. The place is called the 7107 Flavors, which signify the number of islands of our very own country. Of course, where the hungry go, the Tricada must know. Seven One O Seven flavors really amaze us with a so Philippine dining setting. The patrons, the wait and singing staff, there's a TV promoting our country. It is fairly elegant and stylish with contemporary furniture and long bar. By its tagline, Philippine cuisine, culture, and travel. The vision of the owners is therefore within the perimeter of serving Filipino cuisine that reflects the culinary traditions of our 7,107 islands. And the other thing the Filipino would enjoy about the place is the travel desk with books, magazines, and other reading materials that they may read about our beautiful motherland. Further, a lot of activities that management's planning weekly as additional attractions for the diners. Once we had a merienda session featuring Philippine kakanins and other Philippine merienda, along with a talk on Philippine pre-colonial culture, we planned to do something on Oserizal, for example, as one of the topics. Then we would have, uh, we did have the Bayanian here, you know, um, along with a fine dining dinner with Chef Laudico during the Filipino Food Festival in June. Um, what else? We, we showcase provinces. We had a Davao festival showing the tuna of Davao. Anything Philippine, we do it here. It's always an activity going on. In fact, we couldn't keep up with updating uh, what we do. Because hey, there's always something to do every week. Filipino cuisine as one of the most underrated cuisines in the world, establishing 7107 Den has proven something and changed people's perception in Singapore. The bias that has been prevailing in their minds, you know that you know, it was disproved by, by, by the mere opening itself of the restaurant. And uh, throughout the days, in our, in our two years, and it's proven by the number of non-Filipinos growing its day now, they comprise about 30% growing to 40 percent that we are attracting non-Filipinos. Mr. Noel added that many of their customers, especially non-Filipinos, have been enlightened about Philippine food. They came to realize it is just not all about adobo, but there's an array of best picks in the house. Crispy pata, that's, that's one of the mostly uh, best-seller, again, very reliable best-seller namin yan. Uh, we have crispy, aside from crispy pato, we have kare kare. And the surprising thing was kinilaw, inihaw kinilaw. Um, usually, parang initially wary sila because it's uh, raw fish, but when they taste it uh, in tandem with the pork belly, they keep ordering it over and over again. Misang ang Americano pumunta dito. Akala ko, he needed assistance on the menu being a foreigner. He said, No, I, won't, I know what I wanted to order, it's inihaw kinilaw. Whoa! With the tops of that kinilaw, our tummies now crave to be filled in. Here comes the dishes Mr. Noel had prepared for us. It's our turn to taste the best of 7107 flavors. Like a young man. 
Considering Lambians and its location being at the primest area in Singapore, one could have a very satisfying serving or a decent dinner by just spending an around $25 to $40. You can even share as the plateful is good for two persons. Come and visit 7107 Flavors. This is a very flavorful food trip that Filipinos and non-Filipinos will truly enjoy. Mga kababayan, uh, welcome to 7107 Flavors. You see, this is something that we can be proud of. So don't fail to visit us whenever you come to Singapore. Mabuhay ang Pilipinas. Mabuhay kayo. Singapore, we're going to Dubai. Next Friday on Bread and Butter. Try cut a strip to the glitzy tourist hotspot, Dubai UAE. Some of the best shopping malls in the world. Dito na kami sa Medina Jumeira. Mm -hmm. At ano to? Mall. Mall daw ito. Ah! The world's luxurious hotels. Delicious dates. And a lot more. So don't you miss this fascinating city as the Tercada takes us to this super busy construction hotspot. All of these next Friday on Bread and Butter. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting nervous now. She's very pretty. Hi, it's so nice to meet you. Makamapulis kami pag tumawid kami. Makainis na ako. Makainis na ako. Ano tayo pagpunta tayo sa prison? Mabili. Please.